going on guys it's saturn reaper here and we are back again with some more fortnite patch notes there was no leaks this week if you guys were interested in that it was a content update 8.11 not 8.2 so we didn't have any actual leaks the rap that was in the shop today called rivet was actually leaked and then released the same day so that was not a surprise for us otherwise everything that we have leaked previous to today has already kind of come to the game at this point so other than the magma wrap i think we're missing the magma wrap that's the only thing we're missing so Anyways, let's get right into the patch notes here. So V8.11, pretty short patch notes. It's not going to be a very long video. Flintlock pistol, knock, knock, who's there? Flintlock, that's who. Pick the perfect time and knock yourself or enemies back with this new weapon. Pretty cool weapon. I have not actually found it in any of my matches yet because I've been playing one shot, which obviously makes sense. So, continuing, <laughs> Flintlock pistol, available in common and uncommon rarities, found from floor loot, knocks back the shooter, can also knock back the target if they're close enough. So you guys can actually negate fall damage with this weapon, which is pretty interesting. Close range damage, 86 to 90, which is pretty, pretty high. I'm not gonna lie, for a pistol. Significant damage fall off must reload after each shot three second reload time uses heavy ammo unvaulted the impulses increase the impulse strength on vehicles by 344 percent and increase the impulse strength of explosive weapons against vehicles by 233 percent scoped assault rifle got a little buff from 24 23 to 27 26 and re reduce the spawn rate of the baller from 100 percent to 50 percent which i actually predicted that change to happen i thought they were going to do a little bit more than that but they didn't then the one shot ltm which is in the game now we already know what that is we've played it multiple times on this channel then we have a few events coming up so we got the gauntlet solo test event and gauntlet duo test event which is running right now um, from 319 until 3 23 and then 323 to 326 new tournament black heart cup which is march 23rd to 24th which is going to be is that this weekend guys i'm pretty sure that's this weekend starting friday solo game mode participation in this event requires players to have placed in the top three percent global of any gauntlet test event session prior to the start of the tournament the prize pool will be distributed across all server regions with official rules and details released later this week format march 23rd round one all eligible players march 24th round two top 3,000 players from round one. So pretty basic stuff there. Participating in a tournament in the gauntlet test now requires a minimum account level of 15. The requirement was previously at level 10. I don't know why that needed to be changed, but who knows? A couple UI fixes, which aren't that important. Then we have mobile, and then we just have general performance. Greatly optimized bandwidth usage by eliminating transport of redundant information, particularly around inventory and ability updates. This should reduce networking related hitching and desync issues especially during combat don't know about that don't know if that feels changed at all i think the game still feels relatively the same but again this is just a bunch of other stuff that we're not going to worry about so that's it that's the entire patch notes that's all i have for you guys today again no leaks for this update next update which will be next week tuesday we'll most likely have a three or 8.2 sorry which will give us new league skins and stuff like that i don't know if i'm going to wake up early for that one i'll have started classes at that point so we'll see what happens expect an edit from me tomorrow i believe i have the gameplay play for it i'm ready and rearing to go got the vision and everything like that just need to make it happen so i think that's going to be the move and yeah i think that's the major things that i wanted to talk about here so that's all i got for you guys today i hope you guys enjoyed make sure to leave a like sub up share around and i will catch you guys in the next one merch link is in the bio bam